I am a dog. A dog that's incredibly bright. I can talk, read and write. And surf the net all of the day and all of the night. Oh, Neil, you can talk! And much more, Bernie, but keep it to yourself. If we let the cat out of the bag, you'll be a celebrity! If you want to lead a dog's life, the secret's gonna stay with you and me! Watch my chops, shush! It's no joke, the doggy spoke, he said, watch my chops! They must never hear a word, a talking dog! <laughs> How absurd! <laughs> I don't think I can resist, Corneal. Mm, man, these cookies smell good. Now, now, Bernie, we picked up those cookies for Beth. Don't be such a killjoy. Beth won't even notice one missing. Mm. Oh. Mm, delicious. Oh. Um, maybe just one more. Bernie, uh, give me those cookies right now. Uh, come and get them. Mm. The chocolate. So creamy! Oh, the taste is just unforgettable! Bernie? 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 Uh, sorry. Oh, so sorry. Uh, so sorry. Uh, oh, Bernie, Bernie, wake up! Stay calm, Corneal, stay calm. Help! Oh, what am I saying? At last, he's coming around. Bernie, you had us all worried. Yuck, that's disgusting. Get off of me. <laughs> now, now, Bernie. Corneal was the one who came and got help for you. He's a real hero. Huh? Mom! Um, uh, Bernie, I'm not your mother. I'm Beth, Corneal's mistress. Don't you remember? Uh, oh, yeah, sure. Dad! Dad, uh, Bernie, uh, I'm John, <laughs> Beth's husband, Corneal's master. Uncle Rico is, well, well, he's your uncle, and you're Corneal's dog sitter. Don't you remember? Oh, yeah! Uncle Rico! I remember! Uh... <sighs> now, try and get some rest. We'll be right outside. Huh? Bernie, at last! I've been telling you... Ah! Help! It's a talking dog! Ah, somebody help me! Help! It appears that Bernie has suffered some kind of memory loss. It's probably temporary. After all, he's already remembered that you're his uncle. He's well on the road to recovery. Uh... <laughs> Doctor, come quick! There's a talking dog in my room! <laughs> ah, 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 that's him! That's the one! I'm telling you, that dog was talking to me! I'd say he missed his exit on that uh, road to recovery. I wouldn't worry. He's still in shock. This talking dog business is simply a hallucination. He'll get over it soon. It might help to leave your dog here with Bernie. Since he's so familiar with Corneal, it may trigger some memories. Bernie! Once and for all, I am not a hallucination. Yes, you are! I mean, you didn't just say that. I mean, ah! no! Not talking about the hallucination! Not listening. Gotta get better. Bernie, watch my chops. I can talk. You've forgotten, that's all. I'm sorry, but I think I'd remember a talking dog. Uh -huh. oh, this isn't happening. You're a hallucination. I'm not a hallucination, Bernie. 
I'm your friendly neighborhood talking dog. You've just lost your memory of it. What about Uncle Rico and John and Beth? Did they lose their memories too? Bernie, the others don't know. It's our little secret, remember? You're the only one who knows of my talents. Or should I say, new? Talents? You mean there's more? Besides talking? Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, you can write too? Say, this is getting cool. <laughs> Look at this, Uncle Rico! Very nice, Bernie. I didn't know you were so gifted. <laughs> That's just it, Uncle Rico. I didn't write it. He did. Sure. Sure he did. Listen, Bernie, the doctor said you should rest. I think Cornell should go home now uh, to do a little more writing. Where's that doctor? This road to recovery is more like a parking lot. No one believes me! But I swear that doc can talk! They ought to be calling the media! This'll make history! Proof! I need proof! Now I'll be known forever as Bernie Barges, the guy who discovered the world's first talking dog! Prescription for patient Bernie Barges. Early release from the hospital so that he remembers his everyday life as soon as possible. Bernie doesn't get his memory back, he's going to reveal my secret. And then it's curtains. I'll be finished. Membrane. Memorabilia. Memory. There are several kinds of memory. Visual memory, oral memory, olfactory and gustative memory. Hmm, interesting. By calling upon one of these senses, what were they? Sight, hearing, smell and taste. I might have a chance of triggering Bernie's memory. Now let's see. Oral is out. Bernie doesn't even remember the sound of my voice. That would leave... The doctor tells us she's going to release you this evening. Cornel's going to stay with you now, and we'll be back later. Oh, phew! What's that stink? Oh, it's not a stink. It's my scent. I applied a bit more than usual to awaken your olfactory memory. My what factory? Olfactory. Your memory of smells, if you will. Oh, never mind. We'll have to try jogging your visual memory. Now, concentrate on these images, Bernie. Here's when we went to the opera to hear Diva Carmen Pavarotta. And here, we're doing a parachute jump from the top of the building. Don't you remember? Wait, let me... Of course, that's it. We went to the carnival. Eureka! Yes, you remember! And also remember that I'm able to talk, don't you, Bernie? I'm sorry, what was that last bit? That I can talk. Uh, yeah, but just so I'm clear, you're a dog. Yes, of course. A dog that can talk. Yes, yes! I suddenly feel so much better. <laughs> I'm glad for you, Bernie. Are you sure your memory's returned? Yeah, sure. No worries. Show me what you can do again. What about the time you went on that cruise and you had to dive in and save me when I fell overboard? Yeah, that was wild. And the water was crawling with sharks. Bernie. No, no, they weren't sharks. They were piranhas. Bernie. Barracudas? We've never been on a cruise, Bernie. Really? It doesn't matter anyway. 
because I'm gonna pay for a fantastic cruise thanks to the talking dog. What do you mean? You recorded me? Surprise! And I'm gonna play the cassette to John and Beth. And then, hello, Evening News! Ah! And then, hello, Animal Research Lab! Oh, Bernie, you can't! You mustn't! Are you kidding? I'm gonna be famous! Bernie, listen to me. Think of the good times we've had. Try to remember the bliss of your dog-sitting days. Yeah, right. <laughs> Bernie, you will only do this over my dead body. John and Beth, 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 John and Beth. Ah, here we are. Wonderful. You seem to be in wonderful shape. And I've got some great news. Yes, very big news. Are there little green men on the planet Mars? No, even better. Can pigs fly? You're getting warmer, but that's not it. Do you give in? Okay, watch my lips. I'm gonna tell you a big secret. Aw, Cornel wants you to have a cookie. Isn't he just amazing? More amazing than you even know. Mm. Bernie, give me those cookies right now. Come and get them. The chocolate, the chocolate. Oh, creamy, creamy. The taste is just unforgettable. The cookies, unforgettable. Bernie, Bernie, what was your big news, dear? News? Uh, I forgot. I mean, it's not that I don't remember. I, uh, I sure love these cookies. May I? Come on, Corneal. <laughs> Corneal, you're a genius. How did you know I'd get my memory back by eating cookies? I'm only sorry I didn't realize it sooner. Knowing you, Bernie, of course your keenest sense would be your gustative memory. My disgusting what? Oh, never mind. 